Hey guys, Redstone Without Limits. Um, so today we're going to explain something called a register. Now the purpose of a register is to store information temporarily in the computer. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a basic D flip flop. So in other words, a repeater latch. So uh, the way this is going to work is we have an inverted input. And this is um, similar to how my RAM worked. So we're going to just do this. Uh, so we're going to have a, um, a write line or a data in line. And then we're going to have um, basically a AND gate at the end. So we're going to have data going like this. And this will uh, say that we can read it like so. We'll have that on. We'll have subtraction mode on. So, or you could have on comparator mode. Just depends on what you want. So we're gonna send. Um, we're gonna lever these up like so. Okay. Um, we're gonna have a. Uh, a button on there like that so uh, we don't have any data uh, currently on on the data in so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a sign and we're going to label this data in like that and then we're gonna have this as our right and we're going to have this as our read. So anytime we want to um, take out information, we just read from there. And that should be it. Now, if we write something, if we write a zero to the register, then nothing happens. If we write a one, then something happens. Um, it is now stored within this D flip flop since this is a one and if we turn off that lever it doesn't um, alter the input so this is called a D flip-flop and the reason why it is called a D flip-flop is because it is dynamic it can be changed based on a pulse so um, now you may be, may be asking well how do we get this information out of here I mean of course you could just do this but there's no control over that so that is why we have the end gate. We have one input going in, and once we turn on the other input, we get a read. So the idea um, behind this is you would be able to read the information whenever you want to, and you can write information. But um, yes, yeah, so you'd be able to write information at any moment's notice. Now, say you wanted to write the zero, because the state of the lever is currently zero. Um, you would just click the write button while this is off. So that is how that works. If you like this video, then go ahead and hit the like button if you want to see more. Um, I post videos every day. Um, but I'm not going to be posting a video um, for a week because I'm going on a trip but once I get back I will be making videos every day so uh, if you want to see more then definitely subscribe um, like I said I upload videos every day so yeah I will see you in the next video